So this is the nine month update on the family farm. Uh, did get a couple things done this month. You hear the roosters? Uh, go ahead and turn around, let you see the stuff that's changed. Baby goats are getting older. I think they're probably three months old, something like that. They're doing pretty good. My hay feeder kind of got messed up because they were able to get in over there. I may have stopped them now, but hay feeder's working. And one of the big changes is I got the goat tower done. Right there. They like it. And they climb up to the top. And uh, I think there's only one so far that won't, hadn't gone up there yet. Mama goat. But, and then I finally, one of the things I've been dreading, getting the pigs out of here. I got the pigs out of here. And here they are over here, a new big, new pig pen. I think they've been here about three days now. So, so far so good. I got the electric fence run, but I don't think it's working. I don't know what I've done wrong. I need to kind of, look, I've looked over it. It looks like everything, nothing's touching. It shouldn't be, but uh, we've noticed the animals get right up on it and they hadn't shocked them. So. Uh, something's wrong with it. I gotta get a hold of that. So, and then we did last month, this month, we got a companion for the other rabbit. Went to the livestock auction and got a doe right there. To go with the buck and like I said I thought I was supposed to keep them separate but I think they they're doing okay together and he started trying to jump on her I literally as soon as she got in there so trying to mate but hopefully we'll get some babies now now that we got a male and a female and let me take you in here If you see, these are the little birds we had inside the house last month. See them ones with them crazy heads on them? Call them Donald Trump. <laughs> but they're in here now. And we've let the guineas out. You see, there's one of the guineas. And I wasn't sure how the guineas were going to do with the chickens, but they've done fine. There's a couple others. See where they're at. There's another one. There's, there's, there's the other two. There's three guineas in here. So, so far so good. So these chickens get a, another month or so. We'll probably let them out with the rest of these. And that might be it for, for chickens for a while. We might, Might be it for chickens for a while. We'll tear it up. Well, oh, honey, they don't let her eat as much. She goes in there after the fact. I think she may be pregnant. You see, the right side is the babies. So, I'm going to have to separate her, stop it, separate her, because the mom and her don't get along at all. And I don't want her to get picked on. Here she comes in to eat. Honey. Okay, honey.
And these three babies, I don't know which one's which, but they've named them Summer, Autumn, and Winter, I think. I don't know which one's which. Carrie and Haley do. I caught hell moving these pigs. You see they're getting pretty big. And I basically had to go in there and grab them. I got them by their hind legs and carried them over here. So I would guess 40 pounds, maybe more. And Carrie's gotten, as you see, there's a little bit of frost on the ground. It's 35 degrees. It was 31 yesterday. So I think uh, things growing is kind of come to an end. But, you know, Carrie had the pumpkin. She had about five or six pumpkins that came out of that. She's got them in the house now. And... Obviously, we still got to get all that cleared a little better. <clears throat> yeah, there's some stuff out here, but we're probably at the end of this. growing season anyway so I got some work to do out here this winter and I'm gonna get down and clear out below all those trees get real clean cut some limbs up so we can walk under there and I'm probably not gonna go in here but we got four more rabbits at the auction it was a mother and three babies and they're in the greenhouse now and the dog tries to get to them, so I don't know that I'm gonna be able to show them to you without, I don't wanna have to open this too far. Yeah. There's some rabbits there. You know, building this cage, this rabbit cage, for the rabbits that are inside there. So they will be out here, and I'm gonna kind of create a box where they can, they got somewhere to get out of the weather. So, and that's a mama and three babies. They're brown, they're real cute. So, basically, that's it. Carrie's done a little bit of work out here in the cannon shed. Looking kind of nice in here. But, oh. Uh, I still got to go in. I got to pull all this out. I'm going to put a floor in, some insulation, drywall. Bunch of shelving, so a lot of work. Stop. A lot of work to be done in here still. So that's it for the nine months. Nine months. We've been here nine months. It's kind of crazy. A year ago now, we weren't even thinking about this. We weren't even thinking about moving. I mean, it didn't even hit me till December, I think. So. A year ago today, we weren't even moving. And here we are nine months into this project. And pretty enjoying it. So we got a lot of animals now. I don't know what the math is, so I'll try to put it on here somewhere. I think it's 30 chickens, three guineas, six rabbits, seven goats, a dog and a cat, two pigs. So I think that's it. Let's see what that comes up to. Anyway, 
Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And remember, all good stories start with a seed. Thanks for watching.